Blue Origin has another successful rocket launch. Clear Path raises a 30 million Series B. Google's autonomous cars cross 2 million miles driven and more. It's Wednesday, October 5th, and this is Crunch Report. It's Wednesday. Going to a Sharks game tonight. Should be fun. Also, call your mom and say hi. She probably misses you. Today, Jeff Bezos' rocket company, Blue Origin, had a successful rocket launch test, and this time, it tested a safety mechanism that's meant to bring the crew to safety if anything unforeseen was to happen at launch. The launch went off without a hitch. Actually, better than expected. Blue Origin had only anticipated landing the crew capsule, but as an added bonus, they were able to land the rocket booster as well. That's the fifth time in a row they've landed the rocket. All these successful launches and tests work nicely for Blue Origin, which is trying to put a human in space by 2018. Oh my, you gotta walk the walk. I'm so fly, it's money talk. Metamorphic Ventures, a seed stage firm out of New York, has taken the wraps off its latest $50 million fund. It's third to be exact. More than its first fund that was $20 million, but less than its third fund which was $70 million. The VC firm also has a new one word name, Compound. They're the share of the VC world. Compound has had a couple investment exits and it was also an early investor in Indiegogo. That was a really nice money talk. For years now, India has been seen as one of those places that could be the next great home of unicorns. Unfortunately, one venture capital firm had to put its investment plans on hold. Phoenix Venture Capital's new partner hire, Venkatesh Shukla, was tasked with leading the firm's expansion into India. But at some point along the way, Shukla decided he would rather raise his own fund. All the drama has put Phoenix's growth on hold, but the firm says it will move to continue efforts in the next year. Man, I wish I could be in a position to walk away from 60 million of someone else's money because I knew I could raise millions of my own fund. That just sounds crazy. These VCs are crazy. Canadian startup ClearPath Robotics just put some new cash in its coffers today with a new 30 million Series B. The company is building autonomous vehicles that can operate inside warehouses to move inventory from place to place. The genius of ClearPath's idea is that it reaps many of the benefits of autonomous cars, but doesn't have to face the challenges of changing road conditions and other erratic vehicles. The 150-person company has already signed deals with GE and John Deere, but the real value will be in building customized autonomous solutions to replace things like airport shuttles and mining vehicles. Here's a quick one. Google's celebrating another milestone in its self-driving car project. A two millionth milestone, mate. Man. The search giant's autonomous test cars have now racked up that many miles in public road testing, and it notes adds up to about 300 years of human driving based on the average person's yearly total. That's a lot of driving. So if you see a Google car driving around, go give it a little slap on the bum bum and wish it a happy two millionth mile. That's the report for today. I'm Tito Hamzy. Crunch Report airs every weekday at 7 p.m. Eastern, 4 p.m. Pacific on TechCrunch.com. You can also find us on iTunes and on YouTube. And we'll see you tomorrow. 